Hey guys, and welcome to an original who tried this production. Today I'll be doing my C++ tutorial on teaching you how to create your own function. I forgot what number this was. I think it's like 14 or something. But other than that, I'll be teaching you how to create your own function in C++. And so the function we will be creating is just basic, a basic function. Is an add one function. It will add one to any integer variable that we have. So, what we first must do is a function exists outside the main. Well, the actual information pertaining to the function exists outside the main. So, what we want to do, we want to go outside the main. And now, I want to create a function. Let's call it int add one add one is a function name then parentheses int start now you can think of start as a placeholder that would be the if we were doing the function that would be the input I'm going to try to explain it as best as I can You'll probably understand it once you see it. But think of start as a placeholder. So let's open up a bracket. Let's create a new another, another integer. Int new number. It's a new number. Now I'm going to put new number equals start plus one. This is not the this is the function. This is what the function is going to do. We're not calling upon the function yet. This is what the function is going to do. It's going to add one to start. Or add one to the input. Think of start as the input. Just think of start as an input variable. It's holding the place for the... I'll explain it all once it's, everything is there. Now, all functions also have to have a return value, unless you're avoiding it. Well, I'll explain that in a later tutorial. So we have to return new number. Since we're returning new number, and new number is equal to start plus one, we're returning start plus one. So start plus one, it'll add one to the variable, or the input, as I said before. So now what we need is we need the actual function inside of the main. So let's say int rock comma finish. Create two variables. <coughs> rock equals 30. Finish equals, now here's how we call upon the function to use it. We would call it like this, add one. Just how, just how we spelled it before, add one. The function is named add one. And because it's an integer function, we had to put the int here and the int here. Finish equals add one. Open parentheses. Rock. Because rock is the input. Rock is the input variable that we're inputting. So it, when we see this out, see out, finish and L. So now it might start clicking in some of your heads, but I'll try to explain it as best as I can. This is what the function is going to do. So what we just created here is what the function is going to do. It's going to have new numbers new number is equal to start plus one and it returned new number start in this case start is just the input rock is the input this is what the function is going to do correct so start would be the input that we're going to use this is saying what it's going to do so it's going to add one to start rock is the input so it's going to add one to rock this is very confusing so I'll try to put this in the description also 
and best explain it as best as I can. This is saying what it's going to do, though. It's going to add one to start, because start is the input. This is my own definition, because the book confused me, so I made my own definition up to try to best explain it. So let me just show you what it looks like. It's a simple input. Fast forward this. See here, we have a simple value of 31, because the function added one. I'm trying to explain it one last time. This is what the function is going to do. This is what it's going to do. It adds one to the input. This means nothing. This is just uh, this is just a placeholder. That's the word I was looking for. Placeholder. This is just a placeholder for the input. This is the input. So it's going to add one to this. Because this is the input. This is just a placeholder for it. Think of this as zero. That's it. Now I'm getting somewhere. This is zero. Think of it as zero. Unless other or otherwise specified. This is zero. The input is zero in the function. The input is zero. And so new number equals start plus one. Return new number. Now, rock is the input in this. Rock is the input. So rock is equal to 30. So 30 plus 1 is 31. Yes, I think I explained that better this time. Well, this has been an original. We tried this production. I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe. Look in the description if you didn't understand. There's going to be the scientific explanation for it, which might confuse you. Keep your subscription with me. Keep your subscription with me. Subscription with me. I think I, think I, think I you with my, my love. Yeah.